One of the areas that has been most heavily reworked in La Resistance is Spain, which has two new huge focus trees and a variety of unique mechanics related to the Civil War. At the start of a game of Spain, you'll pick between two focuses, one which will set you down the nationalist tree and the other that will cast you as a Republican. As soon as the event for the election of 1936 fires, a military coup timer in the decisions menu will begin to count down from 250 days. Once it expires, the civil war will begin. Using decisions, both the player and an AI controlling the other side will be able to affect the timer. Nationalist actions will decrease it and Republican ones will lengthen it, though it will not be possible to avoid war entirely. For the Republicans, putting the civil war off for as long as possible is important, since they have five focuses that better prepare them for it, each of which takes 70 days. The Nationalist pre-war focuses take half the time, so the sooner the war happens, the better for them. If the Republicans are able to complete the Disband the Army focus, then they will dramatically reduce the size of the Nationalist starting force, giving them a big advantage. Ensuring the war begins before the Republicans can complete this will be a key objective for a Nationalist player. You can track what decisions and focuses the other side is taking via the Decisions tab. At the same time as the military coup timer starts, an on-map decision system will activate that allows the Nationalists and Republicans to compete for military control of each state. Initially, every state in Spain will be under Republican control and contributing three divisions to their army. Through using political power and by completing the Secure the Northern Garrisons focus, the Nationalists can make inroads into these states, while the Republicans push back against them. Only one state can be influenced at a time by each side, and when the war is declared, any that are not wholly for one side or the other will be split on the map. You'll be able to see the total number of divisions each side will start with in the Decisions tab. Each side in the Civil War will need to choose which branch of their coalition to follow. The Nationalists will choose between Fascist, Francoist and Carlist paths, while the Republicans can follow Communist, Democratic or Anarchist routes. No matter which branch you choose, you will need to manage the risk of a split in your coalition and a third faction emerging to join the Civil War. For the Nationalists, the risk is of a Carlist uprising. For the Republicans, the Anarchists. If you are playing as the Anarchists or Carlists, orchestrating this split and rising up against the other factions will be your desired outcome. A week after the Civil War begins, an event will fire that adds massive, unplanned offensive movement and attack penalties to all mainland Spanish states. Each faction will be able to nominate one state every 90 days to remove this penalty from for their side. You'll get a warning in the Decisions tab of which state your opponent is preparing for an offensive. The effect of this will be a longer, grittier civil war. Both sides will have very high surrender limits as well, meaning you will need to root out every pocket of troops that oppose you. Good luck.